So we're going to attempt to talk about the cap rate today, which you know is a strongly used term in the investment industry, but uh, you need to recognize that it doesn't always give the full picture uh, as to whether or not it is a solid investment. Um, there is a couple of reasons for it. Uh, sometimes you look at things that a current owner may or may not disclose as part of his operating expenses. Things like management, the building could be self-managed, uh, maintenance costs, vacancy, closing costs. Um, it doesn't tell a story of the economic picture, maybe of the, uh, of the area of which the uh, property may be in. But nonetheless, uh, I do get asked that question uh, once a month. So I thought I'd just kind of do a quick overview as to what uh, the cap rate is. It's, in essence, it's the relationship between the net income and the property value. Well, how do you get the cap rate? So we basically take the income, the total income, um, it could be anything from laundry to rent, uh, to storage space, um, and subtract that from the expenses, um, the vacancy, and the bad debt. You need to factor those things in because right now, you know, in uh, some areas of the city, you may have vacancy of close to three months. Uh, other areas, you're achieving it uh, in under a month. And it also depends, too, about what, uh, what sort of rents you're asking uh, to get into your lease. So um, important to note that uh, expenses and the vacancy and the bad debt, that is basically the net operating income. That's your NOI. So that's another term that's used. So when we're finding our cap rate, it is in essence the total income subtracted by the NOI and divide that by your property value there. And that'll give you your cap rate. So you can play with any of these. You can play with your, uh, your, your, um, your property values, your income, your NOI to get your cap rate. You can also figure out your property value as well. It's inversely proportional. So it's uh, something to note that when your cap rate is high, in essence, the property values are low. It's an inverse relationship and vice versa. Uh, so that's kind of what cap rate is in a nutshell. If you're thinking about investments, now may be the time to start thinking uh, into the future there before our markets really gain stability and starts turning around. Got questions about what areas are hot, what you should buy, what you wouldn't. Give us a call, 403-809-3523. Enjoy the rest of the summer. Cheers.